We continue now at the top of Daf Tessa Medalis from Maseches Tainus. This is Tainus Daf 9a. The Gemara here continues the statement of Rabbi Yochan. And what does it mean when it says in the Pasuk, Aser ta Aser, you should take off the Maestris? It means Aser Bishvil Shatis Asher. It means if you take off Maestr, then you're going to become wealthy. Ashkechei Rabbi Yochanan Lianuka de Reish Lakish. Rabbi Yochanan found the child of Reish Lakish. Rashi over here explains. Lianuka de Reish Lakish ben Achoso shal Rabbi Yochanan. This was the son of the sister of Rabbi Yochanan. Well, Achar Misaso shal Reish Lakish. This was after the death of Reish Lakish. Kedemukach lekaman. That's going to be proven later on. In any case, he found this child. Amar Lehi he said to him, Emo li psukach. Tell me the Pasuk that you just learned today. So Amar Lehi, so he said to him, Aser ta Aser. I learned the Pasuk of Aser ta Aser. So Amar Le, so he said to him, Aser ta Aser. So the child said, what, what does this Pasuk mean? So Amar Le, Aser b'shvil shetis Asher. So Rabbi Yochanan said, the Pasuk means to say that you give Maeser, then you're going to become wealthy. So Amar Le, so the child said to him, Nola, how do you know this is true? So Amar Le said, Zil Nasi, go test it out, you'll see it's true. Amar Le, so he said to him, Mishari le Nasui la Kodesh Baruch Hu, is it permitted to test that Kodesh Baruch Hu? But the Pasuk says, Lo tenasu es Hashem, you're not allowed to test Hashem. Amar le, so he said back to him, Hachi Amar Rav Hoshia, so said Rav Hoshia, Chutz Mizu, except for this issue. In this issue, you're allowed to test Hashem. Shenemar, like the Pasuk says, Hevi was kol ha-maiser el beis ha-otzer, v'hi teref bevesi v'chanuni na bezos Amar Hashem Tzavakos, talking about bringing the maiser. And then it says, Im lo eftach lochem es ha-rubos ha-shamayim v'arikosi lochem bracha ad b'li dai. I'm going to open up the, the, the heavens and I'm going to give you bracha ad b'li dai. The Gemara says, my ad b'li dai. What does it mean ad b'li dai? In any case, the Pasuk is clear. You bring maiser, you're going to get rewarded. So in this particular thing, you can test Hashem. So what does it mean ad b'li dai? Amar Rami Bar Amar Rav. Rami Bar says in the name of Rav, ad sheyivlu sifso seichem milomar dai. You're going to have so much that your lips are going to be tired from saying enough already. Meaning you're going to have so much bracha, you're going to be saying enough. And so the Gemara continues, Amar Le, so the child said back to Rabbi Yochanan, have imati hasam, if I would have gotten over there, meaning if I would have known of that pasuk that you just quoted, lahay psuka, to that particular pasuk, lo havis trich nalach, I wouldn't need you, Lahoshaya Rabbah, I wouldn't need Rabbi, Rabbi Hoshia, your Rabbi. In other words, you, you wouldn't have needed to tell me this. It would have been obvious from the Pasuk that in this regard you can test Hashem. And the Gemara continues, Vesu Ashkechei Rabbi Yochanan Liyanuke de Reish Lakish. Again, Rabbi Yochanan once found this child of Reish Lakish, the Yosef Amr that he was sitting and he was saying as follows, again quoting a Pasuk. This is a Pasuk in Mishlei. Iveles Adam Tesalif Darko Vial Hashem Yizaf Libo. Means to say that a person's foolishness, that's what causes him to go wrong, that's what causes bad things to happen, but the person, he blames Hashem, he gets angry at Hashem. So Yosef Rabbi Yochanan v'kametame. So Rabbi Yochanan was sitting and he heard this Pasuk and he expressed wonderment. Amar he said, Mi'ika midi t'chsivi b'chsuve d'lo remizi b'oraisa. Is there something that is written in the k'suvim that isn't hinted to already in the Torah? In other words, there must be a hint to this idea in the Torah itself. So Amar Leh, so the child said back, Atu ha milo remizi. You think this is not hinted to in the Torah? Vaksib, but the Pasuk says, Vayetze libam vayecher du ishalachiv. Lemor, mazos osa lukim lanu. This is the brothers, the, the brothers of Yosef. Safe. They were trembling and they said to one another, why is it that HaKadosh Baruch Hu is doing this to us? So you see exa- exactly this idea. Even though it was clear what the reason was, nevertheless, they were, uh, they were, con- they were confused as to why this was happening. So Dal so then Rabbi Yochanan lifted his eyes and he looked at the child. In other words, he was impressed by the answer. Asyu Ime, then his mother came Afikte and she took him out. Amrale, she said to him, Tommy Kame, go away from in front of him. It shouldn't happen to you. He shouldn't do to you what he did to your father. In other words, there was a dispute with Rabbi Yochanan and Reish Lakish, and that caused that Reish Lakish ended up dying. And so the mother was worried that the same fate would happen to her son. And the Gemara continues, Vyamar Rabbi Yochanan and Rabbi Yochanan says, Mata rain will fall, Bishvil Yachid, even because of one individual. But Parnasa, but sustenance, Bishvil Rab, that only comes because of the Rab and because of the public. Where do we see this? Mater b'shvil yachid. We see that mater comes for an individual. Tichsev, like the pasuk says, Yifta Hashem l'cha so tzaro atov loses metar artzcha. So it says in the singular, Hashem should do it l'cha. He'll bring the rain. You see that rain comes b'shvil yachid. Parnasa b'shvil rabim. Parnasa comes for the rabim. Tichsev, because there the pasuk uses the plural. Hinani mamtir lochem lechem. It says I'm going to bring lechem. Talking about, about Parnasa, again, you see that Parnasa comes because of the rabbin. And the Gemara continues, Maisve, we have a question from the following. Braiser, Rabbi Yossi, Rabbi Yehuda, Omer, Rabbi Yossi, Rabbi Yehuda says, Shlosha Parnasim Tovim Amduli Yisrael. There were three great leaders that stood up for Klal Yisrael, Elohim. They were as follows, Moshe, Viaro, Numiriam. 
Moshe and Aaron and Miriam. Vigimel Matanas Tovos Nitnu Al Yadam, and there were three good three good gifts that were given to Klal Yisrael through them. Ve'eluhein there as follows: Be'er that was the well that traveled with them that provided for them water in the midbar. Ve'anan in the clouds of glory. Uman and also the man again which fell from Shemaim and provided sustenance. Be'er bischos Miriam. Miriam the be'er was in the merit of Miriam. Amud Anon bischos Aaron the cloud was in the merit of Aaron. And man bischos Moshe the man was in the merit of Moshe Rabbeinu. Mesa Miriam Nestalek Habeir. When Miriam died, the Be'er left. Shenemar, like the Pasuk says, by Thomas Shah Miriam, it says that Miriam died over there. Uchsib Basrein, it says right after, Velohaya Mayim Lo Eda, that there was no water for the people. Vechazra Bischus Shneen, but then the Be'er returned in the merit of the two that were remaining, meaning Moshe and Aaron. Mesa Aaron, when Aaron died, Nestalko Anani Kavod, the clouds of glory, they left. Shenemar, like the Pasuk says, Vayishma HaKnani Melech Arod, it says that the Knani, the king of Arod, heard, Ma Shmua Shama, what did he hear? Shama Shemes Aaron, what he heard was that Aaron died, V'Nestalko Anani HaKavod, and that the Anani HaKavod, that they left. Uchesavr, so he thought, Nitno Lo Rishos, Leilachem B'Yisrael, that now he had permission to fight with Klal Yisrael. V'hainu Dechsev, and that's what the Pasuk says, Vayiru Kol Ha'edo Kigava Aaron, so the literal translation is that the entire congregation saw that Aaron died. But Amar Rabbi Avo, but Rabbi Avo says, Al Tikri Vayiru, don't read it as Vayiru, and they saw. Ela Vayiru, rather it means that they were seen. In other, in other words, they were seen because there were no more clouds surrounding them. Kedadarish Reish Lakish, like Reish Lakish Darshan's Dom Reish Lakish, because Reish Lakish says, Ki Meshamish Ba'ar Balashonos, the word Ki can be used with four different meanings. It can be used like E, if, Dilma means maybe, Ela, rather, Daha, because, and the idea was again, Ki Gava Aaron, they saw that uh, because Aaron had died, that's why Vayiro, that's why they were able to be seen now, because again, there were no more clouds. So in any case, Chazru Shnei and Bizchus Moshe, so both the Be'er and the Anani are covered, they returned in the merit of Moshe, who still remained. Mace Moshe, but when Moshe died, Nistal Kokul, and then they all departed. Shenemar, like the Pasuk said, says, V'achid es shlosha es haroim b'yerech echod. It says all three shepherds, they died in one month. V'chi b'yerech echod mesu, did they all die in the same month? V'alo Miriam mesu b'nisan, but didn't Miriam, she died in Nisan. V'yaron b'av, and Aaron died in Av, Moshe b'yadr, and Moshe died in Adr, so they did not die in the same month. Elam Alamid, rather, it's to teach us Shenisbatlu Gimel Matanos Tovos Shenitnu Al Yodan that all three things that were given because of them, the three gifts, Ministal Kulan Biyarech Echad, they all left in one month because again they had all returned for whoever was remaining, and then when Moshe Rabbeinu died, all three of them departed. In any case, the Gemara has a question from the Brisa. Almo Eshkechon Parnasa Bishvil Yachid. You see here that there was Parnasa because of Yachid, because just because of Moshe Rabbeinu, there was sustenance for all of Klal Yisrael in the form of the Mon. And so the Gemara says, no, Shani Moshe, Moshe Rabbeinu is different. Kevon de Rabim Huboy Kirabim Dami. Since he served the public, he was a person who was a public figure, so to speak. So therefore, he's considered like the public, and that's why it's possible for the Parnasa to be to be because of him. And we should note over here two other possible explanations of this line. Kevon de Rabim Huboy. It could mean that since he requested it on behalf of the Rabim. Therefore, it's Krab and Dummy. And also in the Mesorah Sashas, they have a different Girsa. Svarim Acherim Kevin De Olim Zuchuso, since he had great merits. Kirabim Dummy is considered like a Rabbim. In any case, the point of the, the point is that Moshe Rabbeinu is considered like the Rabbim. And the Gemara continues, Rav Huna Bar Manoach, Rav Shmuel Baridi, Rav Chia Mi Vastanya. Rav Huna Bar Manoach and Rav Shmuel Baridi and Rav Chia from Vastanya. Havushrichi Kame Durava, they were students that were frequently by Rava. So Kinoch Navshe de Rava, so the Gemara says when Rava died, Asul Kame de Papa, so they started to come in front of Rav Papa. Kolemas de Hava, Omar Lushmite de Velohav and Mistabrilu. Now, anytime Rav Papa said over something and it didn't seem logical to them, Hava Maramzi Adadi, they would gesture, they would hint to one another as if indicating that Rav Papa is not as great as Rava. So Cholash Daite, so Rav Papa became depressed, and we'll continue with this discussion in the next video on Daftes Amud Beis.